I'll be the first to admit, I take Google Maps for granted. It's practically second nature for most of us to entirely rely on this application to get around. And while anyone can plug in an address and blindly follow directions, there's much more to maps than just point A to point B. Here are five of the most useful Google Maps settings you should know. First things first, head on over to navigation settings and make sure everything is up to spec. Here, you will find ways to avoid options like highways, tolls, or ferries. And while this can be useful for certain situations, just make sure you don't leave avoid highways switched on the next time you're taking a cross-country road trip. So whether you live in a major city or you're just visiting, customizing your public transit options is a great way to utilize the versatility of Google Maps. When you tap the train icon, you'll be presented with options for subways, buses, ferries, whatever is available in your given city. But say you'd rather not take the bus, or you need a wheelchair accessible option. This is the place to personalize your trip. Need to be somewhere at 9 a.m. sharp? Set a reminder to leave, and Google will send you a notification around the time you need to head out to ensure you're on time. After you've entered your destination, tap the three dots in the top right-hand corner and select Set a Reminder to Leave. Here, you can either manually select the time you wish to leave by, or set your desired arrival time, and Google will adjust accordingly. Let's say you've got to run by the office, the bank, and the grocery store. Allow Google Maps to plot the most efficient route for you. After you've selected your initial destination, tap the three dot icon located in the top right hand corner and choose Add Stop. If you're visiting a particular area and you're concerned about cell phone service, don't sweat it. Google Maps allows you to download maps for offline use. And although you won't be able to receive real time traffic updates, it definitely beats the alternative. To download maps, tap the profile option and select Offline Maps. Then, Tap to set your own map. Adjust the blue rectangle over the area you intend to visit, and that's all there is to it. You're good to go. Be sure to drop a comment below with some of your favorite Google Maps settings. And stay tuned to Lifehacker for more tips and tricks on how to do everything better.